When, I know why you're always so angry, Zoe. I'm just the only one woman enough around here to say it. And the fact is that you will always be the challenger, never the champion. Which brings me to my next person, our former NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez. My old bestie. Roxanne, I put you on the map the second I put that tag team championship in your back. I'm the only reason you're here. But you know what? What you went through, I'm not gonna touch because it's real. And I knew you, I still know you. I knew what you went through. So I'm not gonna talk about it. But the thing is, how long are you gonna use it as your crutch? <laughs> We're all fighting our own demons, Roxanne. You're not some special exception. The only difference is you're just proof that some of us are a little bit better at handling the pressure than others. Speaking of handling the pressure, Gigi Dolan. <laughs> to be honest, Gigi, I kind of thought you would crumble without toxic attraction and I probably speak for everybody else, but you did it. You were fingertips away from that title. And I saw your video earlier. But let's get one thing perfectly straight. That title says Cora Jade. So why don't you go on and don't let the door hit your big Instagram famous ass on the way out. Which Instagram famous can only make me think of one person, Tiffany Stratton. <laughs> Listen, Tiffany, I love the confidence, the ego. You look the part and Let's be honest, you play it even better. But um, here's an epiphany for you. I run this place, not you. Lyra Valkyria. I don't even know anything about you. I'm not a big fan of birds or whatever other weird stuff you're into, but I'll give it to you. You attack anything with a pulse. And in that ladder match, you showed absolutely no fear. But if there's one person that you should fear in this NXT women's locker room, it's me. Which leaves me with one woman left. Our new NXT women's champion, Indy Hartwell. The biggest shock of WrestleMania weekend. Can you believe it? Everyone's chanting, you deserve it. Let's be honest, I was sitting there chanting, Took you long enough. Indy, this isn't your little fairy tale. This is my NXT, and I am the hero of this story. It's the truth. You can cut through the women's division with your vicious tongue. But let me ask you, what's the reason behind it, hmm? Let me be blunt for a second. Is it because, in your absence, the entire women's locker room took a step forward? You know what, why don't you just do us all a favor and go fly off to wherever else the rest of the women's division is? I don't want to hear it. Watching Sam and Deliver didn't create Jealousy, did it? Oh, I bet it was a big reality check. A real humbling experience. Look at me, Cora. Look at me. If you want to come back, a house on fire, and reach the peak of the mountain on the microphone, go right ahead. I'll give you your crown right here and now. But when it comes to that championship, if you even go near it, I'll rip your eyes out. Oh! Well, Valkyria answered her right what? back. And Cora just, and I mean just, getting out of the way. If she could call herself the hero, she's more like the villain.
and she was just humbled by Valkyria.